Welcome back. The holiday season is here, of course. We already got through one holiday successfully, yes. hopefully. Uh, with that comes a lot of opportunities for traditions, yes. food. food. With us this morning, Candace Boyd Wiley yes. uh, with Mom's Blog. And um, you specifically wrote about keeping in check the stress but also providing the food. Yes, yes, yes. I tell people, make it easy for yourself. Mm -hmm. Do not drive yourself crazy trying to get this elaborate meal on the table. Make it something simple. Make it something that you can make, set ahead, go ahead and hang out with your family while sure. you're cooking. Make it easy for you, don't stress out. I don't think stress. It's, I think it's so easy because you put pressure on yourself to achieve this holiday perfection. Right, And right. really all that is, is spending time with your family. Spending time with your family. That's the most important part. And that's what I love about the recipes that I share with Indie Mom's blog. Because if you know me, I love to cook, but I'm not going to stress myself out about it. No. It's going to be easy. You're going to enjoy it. And we're going to have fun. We're going to yes. enjoy ourselves. And so I love the ideas that you're bringing to the table this yes. morning. You have yes. three very specific, very easy recipes that you can incorporate. And one of the cool things is, these aren't your traditional maybe Christmas dinner recipes. Not traditional. Because you have a cool thing that you guys do. Yes, yeah, so in my family, we do brunch. We I do brunch it. Christmas morning, so I get everything ready the night before. That's the great thing about these recipes. Mm -hmm. You can get everything ready the night before, set it, forget it. Then while we're having our brunch and you're opening up our presents, everything's cooking, and I don't have to worry about it. I can literally you open the present, pop it in the oven, pop the it in the oven and go on about our business. I so much, so much fun, so easy. Okay, so let's talk about what you brought in today. Yes. They are so pretty, too. I can Thank only you. imagine these around the table Because and you eat with your eyes first, yes. right? So if it looks good, you know it's going to taste good. And it smells good, It too. smells good. So we've got a quiche here. Super simple. Get yourself a pre-baked pie crust. Don't worry yourself right. with making dough. You can bake. You can make it the night before. And if you shape it, it to maybe look like yeah. it's homemade, who will never who know? Who will know? Nobody will know, right? <laughs> so you, a simple quiche that you can prepare the night before. You can, of course, it has bacon in it because I love bacon. But bacon, oh, sure. cheese, egg whites, parsley. It's really simple. Mm -hmm. The recipe is on Indian Mom's blog. And that's a quiche Lorraine. That's a quiche Lorraine. Right? Okay. Yes. But again, you can add veggies. It doesn't necessarily have to be all meat. Mm -hmm. But you can make this specifically to your family. And a lot of times you want to put brunch out and leave it out for a while so it's, people can come and. Come in great and munch, take a nap. Exactly. Yeah, scones so are perfect we have for that. Scones. scones are easy for that. This is something that my daughter loves to make because it gets them hands on. She can shape them up. Super easy. Mm -hmm. Again, make them the night before, pop them in the oven in the morning. Your brunch is going to be on the table. Super simple. And you just raised a really interesting point. You got your kids involved. Exactly. Getting That's kids involved is a very big part of it. You're making memories for mm -hmm. the holiday season. Yes. Opposite yeah. of stressing. You're having fun You're doing having it. You're having fun doing it. <laughs> and it's going to taste good. And finally, a beautiful punch. A beautiful punch. You can add adult beverages to it if you sure. like. But I made it kid friendly this morning. Get some cranberry juice, some orange juice, fresh cranberries, and an mm -hmm. orange. And you've got a tasty, delicious drink. It's awesome. Kids, it's easy. Yeah. Easy peasy. And it's all about the holiday. We've got the cranberries, got the orange juice, the it's flavors, beautiful. the arom aromas of holiday season. You'll want this. I always love doing a big vat of the kid-friendly version. And if people want to do their own additions, the they side. can do it on the side. Serve it on exactly. the side. That's exactly what we do. Candace, I love the blog. I loved how it was written. It was short, concise, and so important for us all to remember what's truly important on the holidays. Thank you. Thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. We got